But now the sun will never set on the Danimal Kingdom. Another starter has fallen to the mites of the Danimal Kingdom. Welcome back to another Dan Squared video, you Danimals. Seven Star Infernape is here. And just like we all predicted, it had 75% special attacking moves. <laughs> Okay, that's not what we predicted. It has the ability Iron Fist and it doesn't have any punching moves. It has Flare Blitz, Grass Knots, uh, Terra Rock, Terra Blast, and Aura Sphere. And this raid is an absolute beast, but I love it, super fun. We had a blast on our night one stream. Great to get in the trenches with the Danimals. And as always, my community came through with the builds. I wanna thank uh, Deathbleed, aka Derek Fung, for sharing me this Appleton build, and a shout out to Fire Demons. I know I'll give you shout outs later, but double shout out, shout out squared to Fire Demons for helping us really fine tune this strategy. Appleton is the star of today's video. Full build and strategy in the description, but let's go over it quickly. We are Terra Grass, of course. Uh, the EVs, it's going to be max special attack, max special defense, so go ahead with 26 calcium, 26 zinc, final 4 in HP, throw it in HP up. Thick fat, super important. This is an ability patch, hidden ability. This halves the damage we'll take from Flare Blitz from Infernape. Why Appleton? Because of the move Apple Acid, which every time it hits, it reduces the target special defense. So our damage compounds. We have that grass and dragon typing. So we're not taking any super effective damage until we terrestrialize. And of course, thick fat, like we just talked about, allows Appleton to tank those hits, even from super effective uh, Flare Blitz. Now let's see the build in action. But the action isn't going to pick up until Infernape negates the stats and abilities on our side of the field. Before that, just put your controller down, wait for the negates, and then go, go, go. There is the Nullify. We haven't moved yet. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, so be patient. Wait the time for the negates, and then turn one, enjoy the amnesia. So we have a, a set course of actions we can follow to easily solo seven star Infernape. So that's going to start with waiting for the negate. Thank you, fire demons. And then what we're going to do is our two amnesia. And now let's do a quick heal. Or, you know what? Let's let's go right to Iron Defense. Let's go right to Iron Defense. So we'll have our plus four special defense, our plus two defense. Oh, this is devious. Oh, I don't like the burn. Just the chip damage and the extra animation. But okay. So we have our two Amnesia. We have our Iron Defense. Now I'm going to Apple Acid. That way it'll lower Infernape special defense. Especially because I think it's about to negate itself, right? I would get, I would wager that it's about to go... Yep, yep, yep. Okay, perfect. Two Amnesia, one Iron Defense. And now we're going to go into Apple Acid until we can Terrastalize. And once we can Terrastalize, we're going to Giga Drain and Terrastalize because it restores some HP. How much damage is this doing right now? That's more damage than I would have liked it to do. But, you know, we can't always get what we want in life. So I actually might throw in an HP cheer at this time, especially because we're burned. But I'm low and burned. So we, I'm going to I'm gonna HP cheer. I want to get rid of this burn, that extra prep damage. Uh, chip damage, not prep damage. Holy guacamole. All right, so we got a good RNG heal. Uh, another good teammate, Arcanine, one of the best teammates because it has Flamethrower to potentially burn Infernape and half the physical damage. And for, uh, Arcanine also has the ability Intimidate to lower Infernape's attack, helping us tank Flare Blitz. So now at this point, let's just refocus, plus two defense, plus four special defense. And the New York Mets just defeated the Milwaukee Brewers in game Three of the wildcard series. Let's go Mets. We're coming for you, Phillies. Red October. Mm -mm. So now I'm back to Apple Acid. I'm back to Apple Acid. Uh, I took a detour from the plan because the HP was getting low and the burn. But we did... Again, This the step-by-step -step is going to be in the description of the video. 
but we did, we waited till the stats were negated, two amnesias and iron defense, and now we're apple We want to apple acid until Infernix at minus six special defense in general. Once it's at minus six, we don't, we can switch to Giga Drain for some extra HP. So let's take a look. We're restoring, still we're not, still restoring what I, as much as I'd like. We're at minus one attack, fine, minus three special defense. We're still good. But now we can terrestrialize. And so we're gonna terrestrialize, use Giga Drain. That's gonna put us to max HP. So now we're really in the driver's seat. So funny enough, just doing nothing in the beginning of the match, again, credit to one of my uh, community members, Fire Demons, for suggesting, what if we just wait until the negate? Waiting to the negate helps because we don't take any early ch damage before our stats end up getting negated because beforehand I was doing an amnesia and an apple acid and we were just waiting until our stats were negated to power up. This way we had take zero damage until we can actually start using amnesia. So that way we can use amnesia twice it never gets negated. Big brain. Yeah, another shout out. I did it earlier in the video, but Derek, thank you. Derek Fung for the uh, death bleed for the build. It's a, it's really a, a team effort here. It takes a village, especially in a raid like this. Very fun, very difficult. I'm yapping a lot. It probably feels like you're watching one of my streams. All right, so we're gonna continue apple aciding. While I'm doing this, I want to take a second to credit Game Freak with making a really surprising, difficult, and fun raid. Infernape with three special attacking moves was not what I expected, especially with the uh, Iron Fist ability. So credit to Game Freak keeping things fresh. Probably the most fun I had trying to figure out a terror raid in a couple, definitely since before the summer. And some of you were watching like, I watched the stream and there was a lot of pain. There was the pain, but the pain makes the victory feel even better. So I think I won't break this shield. Let me, I don't think this breaks, but just to be to be careful, before we break the shield, I want to attack cheer. I want to do this because I want to get this raid over as soon as possible. Because now, as soon as we break the shield, Infernape goes monkey madness mode and it's absolute mayhem. And what I mean by that is it will use Swords Dance and Focus Energy. Swords Dance and Focus Energy. All right, I'm, you know what? I'm gonna slow play it. 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 Because the critical hit happened even before the Focus Energy, I'm gonna heal cheer, slow play it, because we go second. I don't want to take a chance. I'm getting great RNG, wow. Hope you get great RNG. And just in case I haven't mentioned it, make sure you have at least one Intimidator. Now, now we're ready, now we're ready, now we're ready. Is it at minus, it's at minus five, so we'll use Apple Acid again. We should be in maybe two hit range. Cause once we pop the shield, it's gonna be Monkey Madness. It's gonna be attacking twice. It's gonna be Focus Energy. It's gonna be Swords Dance. We want to get out of here alive. So the attack tier makes it so we only need one more hit. So we should be able to now just win. All right, we should be able to just press Giga Drain and win. But right now I'm gonna go for the, we don't need to Apple Acid, but I'm gonna go with Apple Acid over Giga Drain because it does five more base damage. We should just win because of the attack tier too. Oh, okay, we don't win. Okay, now we win. Now, now we win. The clock's going down, but look at this. Easily, consistent solo. It, it can crit us, that's not gonna kill us, that's okay. But now the sun will never set on the Danimal Kingdom. Another starter has fallen to the might of the Danimal Kingdom. Easily solos in the chat. The ever important question, what Pokeball are you using to catch 
Seven star Infernape and Pokemon Scarlet and Violets. Going with that fastball, the red and the yellow. Too clean for my Infernape. If you enjoyed this video, please consider dropping a like, leaving a comment, or using Apple Acid on that subscribe button for more Dan Squared. Thanks for watching and happy Infernape season.